Greetings and salutations, everyone. My name is Featherhoof, and welcome back to Forgotten Anne, where she's, she's been sitting here thinking about her life and her decisions, remembering the poor Scarfy guy. But, you know, you can't dwell on the past. You can't dwell on the past. You gotta move forward. You gotta move on. You, can, you know, if you just dwell on the past, you're not living your life. So Anne's gotta do whatever Anne's gotta do, which I'm kind of hoping this game... The storytelling picks up a little bit because I need to know a couple of things, okay? A, where is this place and why do creatures get caught? Why do objects get consciousness when they come here? B, why are Anne and old dude, whose name I can't remember off the top of my head, master, whatever, why are they the only humans here as far as I've seen? And C, Who are these rebels, and what are they rebelling against? I kind of want the game to tell me that. So, let's hope that, you know, the game decides to tell its story in the near future. But other than that, I'm still having fun. So, we're going to get up, and let's get to going. we got to give Tiffany her, uh, wrench. Tiffany, we have your wrench. Do you, do you want your wrench? I has. I has for you. And wee! And I got wings. Hi, Tiffany. I found your anima wrench. Here you go. Oh, exactly what I needed. Thank you, Anne. You're most welcome. Any progress? Almost done. R this really? That that's that's almost done. When Master Bonku was setting up Bonku. Okay. Accidentally dropped it on his foot. Oh, right. I completely forgot about that. Setting up the you vault, huh? All this intricate machinery for us, and here I am struggling to open a gate. Uh, that's kind of busted. That's crazy. One day we're having fun, the next the rebels are here. I do wonder what will happen tomorrow. Hmm, I think that should do it. And hopefully, Master Bonaku yeah, won't decide to to destroy you tomorrow. He, uh, he sort of insinuated that. Okay, that didn't work. Oh no. I'm sorry, Anne. Don't worry, Tip. It'll take more than a broken gate to stop me. Especially seeing as I've got What oh. happened to the gate? The gear's broke. I'm not getting this open anytime soon. Sorry, Anne. But don't you worry, Nun. I can fly. You know, I may be afraid of heights, but you know what? I want those wing things. That'd be cool. Okay, but but why? What, I mean, obviously they do a lot of damage, but this reverse supplied the workshop with anima. I can't fix it. You you could try. I mean, jeez, don't be so ne such a negative Nancy or a negative Anne, I suppose. Plonk. What was that noise? I heard a clunk 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 noise over there. Oops, wrong way. It's a basketball. I hear a basketball. It's a ba No, it's not a basketball. That's a shoe. Enforcer. What are you doing? I'm trying to fix the pipes. We have no anima at the workshop. Wade, huh? Was expecting us to shit the last section of the ether bridge today. You won't help. It's beyond repair. Uh. Uh. I don't know. That's beyond repair. Look, kicking won't help. Definitely won't help. The reverser at the watchtower is broken. You can't fix the flow from here. Oh, okay. I'll never go home now. I'll never again feel my owner's feet. Never again will I go hiking or climbing or, or running or... I'm on my way to restore Anima to the workshop. You are? Wonderful. We might actually get to go home. I miss feet most of all. What do you miss uh. most of the human world, Enforcer? I mean, I gotta tell you, you know, of all the fetishes, I mean, one of the ones that freaks, like, cringes me the most is, like, the foot fetish. Because, like, to me, feet are gross. They are, like, the most disgusting thing on the human body. But well, one of. But still. <laughs> but I guess he's a shoe, so I guess he would be fixated on feet. I could tell him. Well, I... What a question. Where's Strut? He's at the workshop. He's in one of his moods today. Oh, is he? Now stop kicking those. But it's all I can do. He's got a point, actually. 
uh, yelling at him for kicking things is kind of like, you know, yelling at, you know, someone coming up and yelling at me for using my thumbs to play the, on the controller. I'm sorry, buddy. I feel, I feel, man, I keep making myself feel awful. Don't tell Struct I kick the pipes. Okay. Oh, it's a shovel. Um, and we got little bobits down there. Oh, are they, are they like jackhammers? I think they're jackhammers. Hmm. Let me try something. Nope, that did not work. Okay. So I can kind of well, see where. Okay. Oh. We've got an emergency cylinder here somewhere. Mr. Strutt. Is that a teddy bear? How's the situation? Let me tell you about the situation, Enforcer. Yes, what's the situation? My stuffing soaked, and the rebels blew everything up. We've got zero anima to ship off to the last section of the ether bridge. And someone stole my lunch. <gasps> Uh, sounds like a bad morning. Rough, morning. Oh, rough doesn't even scratch the surface, Cupcake. I had to connect the pipes to a dispenser, but it needs anima. I know we've got an emergency anima cylinder somewhere, but now that you're here, why don't you make yourself useful and load the dispenser for me? Dude! I think on your hand for a reason, right? Oh, yeah, but you don't have to be so upfront. Now, here's my question. Okay, here's my question. If this is a place full of inanimate objects that have been forgotten and are now here and have a consciousness does the cigar that Mr. Struct is uh, smoking, does that have a consciousness? Is he murdering it right now? I bet that's the case. It was a rebel, wasn't it? What the hell are you? Is that a, it's an anvil, I think, but I can't tell what's next to the anvil. Oh, it's another so oh, it's a sock. Okay, with a hard hat on. Why the sock has a hard hat on? I don't know. So how do I... Oh, that's right. Cha-cha! -ja! Got anima again, fellas! Look alive! Great work. I am powerful to have to have Hell. What? You over for a medal? What I'm hoping for is to get out of here. I need to get to the tower ground station. Huh. You can try, but it looks like the rebels have blocked your way. It's your site. Don't you know a way to get out of here? Not interested. Priority one is the ether bridge, remember? I do, but... I forgot my chrono calibration unit on your desk in the watchtower this morning. You could go and get it for me. You're way out of line. Ho -ho! I need to get to the tower ground station to stop the rebels. Well, search yourself. Okay. Here we go and get his... Thing. Why don't we go get his thing? Huh. But I, I sort of see where the story is going. So I, I'm assuming here what we have is, uh... They, oh, hello. Uh... So, the people, Master Banku and Anne, are stuck here, maybe? Oh, I can't do jack without anima. I can't even use my wings without anima. Huh. I'm not staying. I need to get the package for Strut. Why are you running errands for that hot? Don't ask, Tiffany. Yeah, don't ask. The player's making me do this. Because <laughs> he's a completionist and he plays RPGs and this is the kind of shit that he does. He's a Thing. Was this? This is the chrono calibration unit struct asked for. Okay. Neat. Awesome. Now, the question is, how the fuck do we get out? See you later, Tiff. Take care, Anne. Uh, can I? How do I get out? I don't have no amina. Where do I get more amina? What? Okay. Guess I'll have to steal it from one of the things that I powered up down here. Like my room over here. My room doesn't need extra amina. She says because I have to leave this stuff behind anyway. Mine! Okay. 
<laughs> Blonk. I blonked my head. <laughs> hey, buddy! I got your stuff! To enter in. Oh. There you go. One CCU unit. Good. we got work to do. Why don't you get out of here? You can use the crane, buttercup. Hey! Thank Thanks you. Help me go. I mean, no, no reason to be rude. Okay, we can use that crane over there. What I want to know is... Okay, but they need that anima, so I can't take it. Oh, I have full anima anyway. Yoink. Hooray! I did a thing. Actually, this is probably like the alternate way if I didn't go help Struct. So, screw this, you know, we're gonna... But there might be stuff. So we gotta go look for stuff. Cause you know me, I have to find the stuff. Got it! Aha! Hmm. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. I want to try something. So it looks like this thing can use more amina. It doesn't look like it's full. And... Nope. Okay. Well, that was a waste. this do? Try to grab it. Hooray! I done did a thing. Oh, that just that caused the elevator. Okay. And then can I go up again? Oh, I see what you want me to do, game. Okay. I think. Maybe. Maybe. No, not that. Damn it. There we go. Okay. I don't know why that did, why I was having so much trouble with that, but uh, I got it eventually. Did that work? What the fuck is that in the background? The music change. It's just me under the music change. Okay, what do we do? What what do we do? Doesn't work without anima in the circuit. All right, so I gotta give it amina, huh? Okay, how do I... How do I does? Nothing. Wait. Nope. Hmm. Right, so I gotta get amina over here. Somehow. Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Oh, okay, I see. I see what you... I almost, I almost stole the amina from those guys. And, like, killed them. I don't want to be doing that again. Not if I can help it. <laughs> I still felt like such a douchey thing to do.
Bye, Strat! Oh, yeah, hopefully see you never! But you're kind of a douche. With, by the way, a really bad voice. It sounds like your guy just doing this kind of voice! Say somebody has only the vaguest recollection of what a like, perhaps a gruff uh, New Yorker accent might sound like. I mean, everyone else's voices were kind of okay. It was just this one that, like, struck that I didn't like. Come on, you can do it. A little faster, please. And now it's dark. Good for me. And now it's not. Oh, crap, are we... Was that a one-way trip? Okay. The security depleter is on, is on, but no one was mending the checkpoint. Passing through the depleter will empty my Arca. Alright then. I will take it! Oh, no, I can't take it. Um... Uh, hmm. Uh, is there a way to, like, get around that? Or... Ah, damn it! Too late! Fine. Well, I didn't get a little symbol above my head that said, This could have been done a different way! Stop! Stop! The train is not clear to leave! Stop! Well, then stop it! Move faster, searchlight-looking guy! Hi! Oh, there go the rebels! We'll never see them again! Start this train. I'm going after them. You can't! The lever releases the clamps on this platform. Then how was the other train able to leave? Rebels must have had help. Are you suggesting we have a mole? Who? Perhaps a mole! Station master packs. I see. Where can I find him? She uh, should be in his office. I'll should be? This. Don't go anywhere. I hope he is. I'm telling you, there's something fishy about packs. He's even cheating at cards. Who does that? Lots of people. Yeah. Okay, since we have a lever to fix, I will fix it! Hello? Ah, crap, that's right, I don't have no amina. Alright, Mr. Pa- is that your name, Pax? You have a stupid head. Station Master Pax. Madam Enforcer. It's been a while since your last visit. To what do I owe the pleasure? Like you would not know. Rebels just pulled away from the platform. Your security guy suggested you might have a mole at the station. A mole? Not under my leadership, Miss Enforcer. Unless it's However, you! Sekti down there is the one responsible for screening the passengers. If someone let in the rebels... Uh-oh. Today, it was probably him. I don't have time for this. One of them must be the mole, but they keep accusing each other. So there has to be a way to figure it out. Hmm. There has to be a way to tell which one it is. Let's see here. I can't use the diverters to change the animal flow. I can use, okay. Marika isn't charged. So what? Okay, so I can't do what she just said. Oh, wrong button. You! I spoke with the station master. He accused me, didn't he? Mm, yes, he Pat did. claims that it's your fault the rebels got away. Backstabbing sundial. He never liked me, and now he's trying to frame me. I don't know what to tell you. I'm no mole. Do what you think is right. Ah, compelling argument. Compelling argument. Sir, I come back to speak with you. What do you got to tell me? This is your last chance, Pax. I want the truth. I'm sure I don't know what you mean, madam. Pax, you can't fool me. Don't make me get out the Arca. So it's time to waste. I need anima to release the clamps locking the train. Uh. Is there anything else I can help you with? 
Sectis them all, you're a lie. I don't know what to go with! Well, I can't be certain. But if there were rebels in the station, then he wasn't doing his job. Go talk to Shakti. I'm sure he'll confess if you put a bit of pressure on him. What if I put pressure on you? Between us, I'd step lightly. Don't trust Sekti mm. one bit. Yeah, what if I don't trust you one bit? Because, I mean, look at that hair. I mean, honestly, who can trust that hair? I can't trust that hair. I mean, really. Anyone with hair like that, you just can't, you just can't trust. You're bad. Ooh. Okay, that didn't work as well as I hoped. <laughs> that led to nothing. Oh, wow, I can't. I can't talk to Secti anymore. Oh boy. I mean, I don't want to pick bad because I'm going to feel bad about it if I pick the wrong one. What if I pick the wrong one, guys? What if I do? What? Oh, are you kidding me? Okay. Let's go with the evidence we know, okay? Pax is the station master. So, stuff that happens here is on, on his watch, pun intended. But Sekti is the one who's responsible for all the passengers, for, for verifying passengers, isn't he? Isn't that what he said? And Sekti, Sekti sounded more... He sounded more guilty. He's like, he accused me, didn't he? It was he, he accused me. And it's like... You know, you're... Oh... I'm, I'm calling it Sekti. I think it's Sekti. Alright, buddy. Be prepared! No, 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 no! It wasn't me! Ugh... <sighs> Second, the security officer at Tower's ground station was responsible for the rebels' presence at the station and their escape. With the mold dealt with, I can concentrate my efforts on getting the train going. The rebels have sabotaged the lever, releasing the brakes, so I need to find an alternate way to power the clamps to release them. Okay, so that... What... But what does Pax say about this, about me doing this? Is she gonna write, you know, it doesn't matter which one you pick, she's gonna write that? I mean... I distilled Sekti. Once again, you made the right choice, Madam Enforcer. How do I get the train moving? Our visitors from this morning sabotaged the lever controlling the clamping system. The train is locked to the platform. Oh, is it? Can't we unlock it? I have no idea. I don't spend much time on the floor, if you know what I mean. You're no, I don't. You're a helpful one, aren't you? Uh... I don't, I, I don't know, man. I don't trust him in that hair, but I still feel it. I still feel I made the right choice. I don't like the fact that the game makes me make that choice. But uh, I guess we'll. Uh... Okay, and then this goes like like that. Ah, I done did it! Hooray! Right, down you get. Come on, down. Down in. And down. And I feel bad. Choo choo! Okay. Play this triumphant music. All we did was get a train going. Okay, well guys, I'm going to end this here. This seems like a decent enough time to end it, so that's what I'm going to do. 
So, um, yeah. Interesting. Interesting game. I did notice something when I loaded up my game save today. Um, it does say storylines was one of the options. So they do consider they don't have save files, they're storylines. So I do like that the you know you could choose different paths in this game. You go back to the game, if you remember your choices, try and do something different each time, see how it affects the story. I wonder how much effect it really has on the story. Because, you know, it's like, you know, you, you look back at games like, you know, Mass Effect and stuff like that. It's like, yeah, they, you can make choices, but how much effect do they really have on the grand scale of things? You know what I mean? I wonder what the, how, how much it's going to change here. I wonder if, like, if I had chosen wrong... If it, yeah, I may have already chosen wrong. Who knows? It, you know, the mole really, is going to come back and bite me in the ass? If... Uh, the fact that I killed Scarfy back there, is that going to come bite, bite me back, you know, come back to bite me in the ass? Or is it just, you know, something to make you feel bad in the moment? Because it's working! Damn it. I mean, the fact that she's, you know, cold-blooded enough, to, you know, cold-hearted enough just to go, oh, I need to get going. You! Give me your life force! You know, so that I can power up the, the you know, the, the shit to turn off the brakes. That's a cold-hearted bitch! Damn, Anne! I mean, I, obviously she wants to get home, I get that. You know, she don't want to be in Forgotten Place. Why she's in Forgotten Place, I'm not entirely sure, but... Again, hopefully the game will... Tell me in the future, that'd be nice. <laughs> but for now, guys, I'm gonna end this here. I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you had fun. Hope you're looking for forward to more of this, because I know I am. But, that's for next time. If you enjoyed this one, however, please let me know with a like, comment, subscribe, share it, or you can click on the annotations for other videos I've done. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.